Our journey to trace the roots of Ronald Sevolime, the alleged attacker of State Minister for ICT Ida Nantawa, saw us head to Nakabugo village located in Bulaga along Mitiana Road. Sevolime, who was suspected to have been tracking the minister's movement, was gunned down and killed on Sunday. According to Sebulime's family, he was working as a welder, making door and window frames. They say he was a devoted single parent of four children, having lost his wife in 2012. It's very social to everyone. Sebulime's sister, Irene Nakazwe, says that on the day he was killed, he was heading to St. Andrew's Secondary School, Kabimbiri, located in Kayunga District, for the visitation day of his two children, one in Senior 1 and Senior 3. But I think this is someone who even didn't know that he was bypassing a minister. It was Vidi. Does he rarely uses the road unless we are going to see the girls. She claims to have spoken to him at around 11 a.m. Kept calling his phone, he was not picking. Kept calling, he was not picking. We started getting disgusted. The, the girls were hungry at around five. She says that after waiting for him for several hours, they left the school and boarded a taxi <laughs> heading home. It is then that they learned the shocking news. She called Irene Ronnie Bamkovia Masas. We burst. That was. We had reached Gaya's town. <laughs> Nakazwe says the family was supposed to gather at Sebulime's home in Nakabugo, but they were warned by the LC1 chairman not to go to their place due to the heavy security deployment. As they were sloping down, coming this side, they asked them, Where I, I, Sima, 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 they stood said, eh, you mean we are not meant to come? We didn't know. We didn't know people were here. They had to push her and slapped her by the back. Then she rolled from the other extreme end. Ronald Sebelime's home was thoroughly searched this morning in the presence of the sister, but nothing harmful was found. Some of his friends who came to console the family are in shock. Zenga uli debu binyo kumutu guba muti dobo ima genga ati banga li mazena li sima nyinti mubi na aliba deneka nganti alimua kantu kona nita ina muze guna. We later visited St. Andrew's SS Kabimbiri to verify his sister's claims. The school staff declined to appear on camera but they confirmed that they knew him and his motorcycle and that his children were at this school and had been expecting to see their father. Other people who know Sebulime from the Central Riders Association and other bike riding associations say the incident has left many unanswered questions. Some of the riders also claim they have to look over their shoulder each time they ride a motorcycle, even when they are not harboring ill intentions. Many questions now remain unanswered as investigations into the matter continue. Suhail Mugabe, NTV.